Hello, my name is Patricia Elize. I'm an immigration attorney located in Miami, Florida, and I help people navigate through the immigration system. On Monday, December 7, 2020, the Department of Homeland Security announced that temporary protective status, also known as TPS, and all of the valid documentation granted under TPS, such as employment authorization, will be extended through October 4th, 2021. The countries which will be granted an extension are Haiti, El Salvador, Honduras, Nepal, Nicaragua, and Sudan. Currently, TPS beneficiaries don't need to pay a filing fee or to file any application to maintain their TPS benefits. TPS was originally established in 1990 to aid nationals of countries who need protections from their native country because it's either unsafe or because their native country are unable to receive them back. On Monday, September 14, 2020, the Ninth U.S. Circuit Court of Appeals ruled that President Trump had the right to end the TPS program. Now, President Trump had been trying to end TPS throughout his entire presidency and was allowed to do so on September 14th. But with the most latest announcement from the Department of Homeland Security, TPS lives on to fight another day. The Biden administration has announced that they plan to review every TPS decision made by President Trump, and they will overturn the ones that they find to be inappropriate. Additionally, Biden wants to extend TPS to Venezuelans, seeking relief for humanitarian grounds in the most recent years. Now make sure to reach out to us via social media or by calling 305-371-8846 with any further questions.